say, uh, what, what was the difference in that third quarter? Uh, we just knew that we had to come out the second half, um, start fast. Obviously, we had a slow first half. Uh, we got that communicated at halftime. And, um, you know, the players knew that we needed to do better. Coming out of the third quarter, we got a fast start. Um, we got some momentum, and, you know, we ran with it. So it was a good quarter, the third one, third quarter. Bob? Felipe, I imagine Tennessee's probably pretty sick of seeing you. you you've beaten them three times, and – yeah, you know, I think about that Hail Mary. You, you hit him with the, as a freshman. Did you? What just? What do you think about the success you've had against them, and then you know tonight's game too? Uh try to individualize games. Um, but or I do try to individualize games, but not for certain teams. But you know, it's always been fun playing Tennessee. Um, I think they're a good team. I think they're well coached. But Coach Pruitt uh, does a great job. And then you know our guys. We just came out here and we fought today. Um, had a really good game plan, um, had to execute it better in the second half. But at the end of the day, you know, just it's another team on our board. And um, and Tennessee has a great team. They played their tails off tonight as well. And, um, you know, it was just a good win by us. So. Let me know if you've got questions in the chat. Bob. Uh, the bar got me again. Um, hey, you're, in, you're on the season, I think you got 14 TDs and three picks. That's obviously a really nice ratio. In the last two games, I think it's six touchdowns and no picks. So, you know, can't do much better than that. Um, just what, what, what have you thought about your season and especially at that touchdown interception ratio? Oh, uh, to be honest, I mean, I, I would be lying to say I haven't paid attention to it. But, um, you know, it's, it's, it's not my main focus. My main focus is just, Spreading the ball to the guys, uh, and they make plays for me. Um, I'd be super selfish to be up here and take any kind of credit for that. The O line, I mean, those receivers have done a great job, in uh, in wet games and you know windy games, uh, just always bringing their A game. And the O line always bringing their A game. Um, and you know, I, I'd be selfish if I was taking any kind of credit for that. So it's, it's been a blessing. Um, just being at the University of Arkansas has been a blessing for me. And uh, these guys have you know had my back every game throughout the season. So making plays for me, and that's all I could ask for. Yeah, yeah Felipe, um, Blake Kern coming into the game, what does he bring to the offense for you? Yeah, just <clears throat> a current experienced guy. Um, you know, every time he goes out there, um, the very deceiving uh, big guy, but also, you know, as you guys can tell, has a little bit of wheels. Um, but Kern, he's a good player. He works hard, does what he's asked to do. Never hear him complain about anything. Um, he just goes out there and does his job, and he does it well um, in the blocking game and in the receiving game. So um, I'm proud of Kern, man. He works extremely hard, um, and, you know, he got it done. He did his job like he does every every week, week in and week out. He does his job. Yeah, Felipe, I was wondering what you saw in the pass to Burks, that long touchdown pass, and then – Secondly, now you can look forward to next Saturday and being on that opposing sideline in the swamp. Just your initial thoughts on uh, going back to Gainesville. Yeah, uh, on the pass to Burks, kind of a broken down play. Um, you know, he did a great job of working with me. Um, you know, we do those type of things like scramble rules. And, um, and you never know when you need it until you need it. And um, Burks did a great job of redirecting with me. Um, going back out and try to give him the ball. He made a great play. Good catch and finish, and then uh, for the Florida game, man, it, it's gonna be, it's gonna be uh, kind of just crazy. Like not necessarily emotionally for me, but man, I love all those guys on the staff and and the players, and um, and it'll just be fun to get back out there to play again in the swamp. These guys uh, here are ready and excited to play. Florida's a, a really good team, um, as you guys can tell, and it'll just be a really good opportunity for all these guys to go out there and showcase their talent again. Work extremely hard throughout this week. And just for me, um, you know, it'll be it'll be a blessing, another opportunity. But I love all those guys on the staff, the players. Um, I still communicate with those guys. It'll be a fun game. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. So. Yeah, Felipe, y'all finished just under 200 yards on the ground this week uh, after 200 and something last week. Do you feel like y'all have turned the corner on in, on in the run game? We're getting better. We're getting better at all in, in all phases of just offensive. Um, in the rushing game, passing game, and uh, and I thought the running backs run ran extremely hard today. Um, 
picking up those hard earned, you know, yards. So they did a good job and it helped me as well. Open up the passing game. Um, those guys did a great job and a lot of credit to the O-line for creating those gaps. And those guys will tell you those, uh, those gaps. I mean, you know, they were open enough for those guys to hit it and go downhill and they did a good job of getting downhill and getting yards. So really good uh, kudos to the O-line and the running back group for, for getting those yards. Last one, Bob. Yeah, Felipe, just what did you think of the job the defense did allowing you guys to get back in that game by shutting, shutting out Tennessee in the second half? Absolutely. Um, and we talk about it week in and week out, just everybody uh, having each other's back, you know, offense having the defense's back and, you know, vice versa as well. So they did a great job always coming through. Coach Odom obviously does a wonderful job with those guys. And uh, they came out here and they played hard. They played like they do every day throughout practice, every day on Saturdays. They came out here and played hard um, and executed, especially in the second half. And um, it, was, it, was, it was great. It was fun to watch those guys come in up and come up in uh, clutch moments, you know, to help us get that win there at the end as well. Stevens did a really good job tonight. Thanks, Felipe. Thank you, guys.